Hello and welcome to SolidCAD. Today we are going to make this uh, simple part in SolidWorks. This has th uh, three extrusions here uh, and uh, it's 120 degree apart and uh, it's 50 millimeter inside dia, outside dia is 60 and 75 millimeter is the PCD of these, these holes and uh, 8 millimeter, 8 millimeter radius here and 10 millimeter through all this these boards here 10 millimeter cut here or uh, three side this is 90 degree cut here from three three place they're on three places like so you can see it in here the three places this is the cut out here so let's start i'll open a new part on the top plane I will draw a circle of 50 millimeter and another circle of 60 millimeter and one another circle of 75 millimeter. I will change it to construction geometry. Let me change the document property dimensions. ISO for, for diameter ISO I, I will take NC and the radius I will take NC okay so this this is the now I will draw a center line from here to this point so I will get the point here to draw a circle I will draw a circle of 10 millimeter like so and now I will draw a few lines I will if I try to draw here it will take a tangent relation but I will uh, draw try another time and it won't take it like that so I will draw a line like that and go back and convert into an arc and go back and make it a line another line i will make these three lines symmetric this and this is concentric and the diameter of this is eight millimeter as i have told you before and the degree here is 30 degree the sketch is fully defined now we'll extrude it extrude i will take only this and up to 20 millimeter and midpoint mid plane okay okay that i will use the same sketch again extruded boss i will take this up to 20 millimeter mid plane like so okay i will give a six millimeter fillet here here and six millimeter for red fit it here in both sides okay now i will draw a sketch on top plane i will draw a line from here to here and from in in inference line i will use this inference line to make a perpendicular perpendicular relation like so this is perpendicular you guys you can see this is perpendicular here I will make this vertical I will draw another line another center line from here from here I will delete this line I will draw a line another line from here to midpoint of this and make it horizontal so this sketch is defined it will won't go anywhere this is 90 degree as we have shown here as we have shown is 90 degree cut here three places okay I will cut it cut I will take mid plane and 10 millimeter like so I will use S key and take fillet and full round fillet I will take full round fillet I will select this right click and I will select this and right click I will select this and OK 
and once again I will take the fillet same fillet right click click select word right click select right click okay so this is complete now we will linear pattern these things these all and pattern it around this three times like so phase one is complete and now is the phase two in the phase two this portion is uh, gone and there is another extrusion here like so this is the extrusion this there were three previously now it's gone and here is another extrusion of this type and uh, I will use I will make this and there is also a change here there is a 90 degree 90 millimeter at two places uh, here from here to here 90 degree and from here to here 90 degree and 45 degrees plus uh, the pre of the previous one so it will be 135 degree total so let's make this change let me save this first save phase one on the desktop save I will may give it a material which is defined in the in the previous one this is defined AI SI 1020 I assigned that now I will go for change if I try to select this I will try to I will go to surface and delete face I will try to select all this but not all ev everything is selected so it won't delete it so I will go for another, another way I will take this and now I will take the delete face and take all these everything is selected now nothing's hidden so everything is selected delete and patch okay is gone I will take this like so on the front plane I will draw a sketch from here to here I will go up there and come back and convert it into an arc and join this there is a 40 millimeter distance from here to here 40 millimeter and there is a hole of 10 millimeter here through all as you can see it there is a hole of 10 millimeter through all and radius is radius is 10 so and center distance 40 millimeter as I as I have given this we will select this and the radius is 10 millimeter okay so everything is defined let me extrude this I, I will not care about this line I can make a relation with this but as far as as it is in these in this uh, extrusion it's okay for me I will extrude it I will take mid plane and 12 millimeter is thickness of total thickness of this extrusion okay on this top plane I will draw a line from here to here and cut it I will take thin feature give it 2 millimeter through all like so and I will take mid mid plane like so so it will be it will cut it now it is time to move this these uh, extend these uh, cutouts to 90 degree from here to here is 90 degree from here to this is 90 degree again so I will go and uh, I will select this first and I will select move and there are three type of options offset translate and rotate we will take relate uh, rotate sorry and I will wake up the temporary axis and I will give it this temporary axis here and give it 45 degree like so 
so it will move this face to this here like so I will do the same and move face I will use the same here axis and give it 45 degree but it is going the wrong side so I will flip direction like so okay the phase 2 is complete I hide the temporary axis now the both faces are complete I'm sorry I forgot to give the fillet here there is a 6 mm is 6 mm fillet here 6 mm okay and this side now the part is complete thank you for watching and please subscribe